Hello and welcome back to another one of my coin videos. Today we've got a P.O. Box opening video. I love these. Fantastic. Look at all this. Let's get cracking. So yes, do my usual bait and switch thing where I show you all the things I found this week and my travels at work and then my change and bits like that. First up, we've got a Baelic 20 pence jersey. Lovely. Also, we got ourselves Flopsy Bunny. What a find that was. Magic. Also, got an Olympic sitting waiting for me in my change. I was like, yep. I love that. Got ourselves a 1988 round pound. Now these are good. Not the best condition, but still one of the, the popular ones for it to have. Uh, we've got ourselves a shiny. Couple of wee marks, but it's in real good condition otherwise. NHS. Also, my favourite Paddington of them all. With the HST. At least they're not like falling apart. <laughs> there we go. Uh, we've got this round hand, is this the Egyptian arch? Here we go, 2006. Got another money box coin, squirrel nutkin. Lovely. And also, we've got this one today actually. Jersey two pence. Real nice. 1992. Let's go way back. Also, Banknotes, yeah, banknote section. Dun, 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 dun. Got my, I've actually been terrible. I've not actually been collecting Scottish tenors. <laughs> I know. So I got myself a Scottish ten pound Royal Bank of Scotland. We'll take it out as we sleeve. There we go. That's the one with the otters. Also, got the Bank of Scotland £10 polymer. <laughs> this one, interestingly, is ZZ. That's a replacement note. That's what caught my attention. I was like, oh, my first replacement note. So I'm keeping that. Here we go, it's Glenfinnan Viaduct. And pop that there. This one, Mary Slessor, the old school. £10 paper note. Not the best condition, but I realised I didn't have one. <laughs> so I better, I better put one aside, eh? Also, Bank of Ireland £20 note. Now this is in pretty poor condition, but it's there. It's one I've never had before. And there we go. On the other side, Queen's University of Belfast. What a grand building that is, eh? Lovely. And also, yes, this is costing me a fortune. I'm going to see if I can swap this for a double A, though. Because it's an AB. <laughs> Bank of Scotland 100. With Walter Scott on there. And the Keswick Bridge. I've had one of these before, but it was a, a higher prefix, if I remember right. So I'm going to see if I can get this exchange. I'll keep this one for now until I can find a better one. Yes, so, brilliant. Right, what I'm going to do now, start opening up, I'll clear my desk, do a wee magic thing. Back in a second. Yeah, so first up, I got woken up to this landing on my doorstep. So heavy and so noisy. Well, not the card, but the postman. He was just like, thump. And he threw it, threw it in my letterbox. There we go. Got a postcard. I love postcards. And this one is from Pocket Point. Penguin. <laughs> I said that three times in a row after a few. There we go. Dear Callie, here's a postcard from my adventures in the Birmingham Botanical Gardens. It's a lovely place. Let's go read it out. Birmingham Botanical Gardens and Glass Houses. Here's your wee address and website. So, thank you so much, Pocket Poet. They look really nice. I'll have to make my way down there one day, have a look. Nice, lovely. I'll pop that back. I love postcards. I always put postcards back in the... So when you see the live streams, you'll see them on display. Now this one, 
as a banknote. No, because I performed a trade on the mister with a chap called Hunting for Coins on the mister. And he says he's up for trades, banknotes and stuff and the like. So if you're on the mister, which I've just, I've been on for a wee while now. I just been really terrible for adding things on because I've got that much stuff. I hate bragging about it, but I've got just far, I'm at that point now where I've got far too much stuff and I can't get anything done. But he saw I had some notes that he wanted, uh, a note that he wanted, and uh, he offered me some notes that I didn't have, that I should have had. I've got to make sure there's no addresses in here, so please watch out for any evidence. There we go. Right, now, the original five pounds with Churchill. I have one of these somewhere already, I've got a couple, but this was to make up the shortfall because I traded a £20 note for him and he says, I'll trade you £20 back face value and I'm like, no problem, because I didn't actually have these notes. I should have, but I had, these notes were around when I wasn't back in uh, collecting again and um, it was just in the back of my mind, I never got them, so here, I've got them now, I'll put these away in some plastic sleevings. You, you all remember this one, Bank of England with Elizabeth Fry, is it? There we go. Nice. And this one here, I like this one back in the day. Charles Darwin. Look at that beard. <laughs> Lovely. So, nice wee trade there with Hunting for Coins on the Mr. Is there a wee note here? Yeah, brilliant, excellent, a wee note, no evidence. Hi, thank you for swapping with me. I hope you're happy with these English banknotes. Thank you for the swap from Hunting for Coins at the Mister. So yes, check him out. He's up for trades. And uh, from what I led to believe, um, the more you trade on the Mister, the more you get, you get, you get ratinged. And you know, I'm looking to boost my rating as well. So I need to really list all my stuff that I've got that I've got spare. So, uh, thank you once again. Please, with the notes, might do uh, another trade research another day if I find something. You know, because I've got the Scottish notes, he's got the English notes. Hey, hey nice, nice to trade. Anyway, on to the next one. Got ourselves, it looks like, a uh, Pop Joy Jobby, is it? Let's find out. Evidence, evidence, oh hide the evidence. Yes indeed, it's a Pop Joy jobby. Now got a couple of these, so I'll pop the second one aside. Queen's 95th birthday. There we go. Dripping the colour. Now Nice design of the horse and all that, but it's still very plain, isn't it? It's, you know, they could have had something, something else, but yeah, it's a horse. Look at my horse. My horse is amazing. It's not, not quite as epic as the back door I gave Dan Temple. That was a donkey, I know, but still equine. But yes, British Indian Ocean Territory. Usual specifications, Cooper Nickel Diamond Finish. 8 grams, 27.3, and always issue limit of 2750. Nice. So that's the third in the Queen's 95 set. There's only four to get, one more to get, and I'm done for that section. That's nice, that's, you know, not bad at all. On to the next one. Oh, what's in this? Mysterious. Is this something I've ordered? That must be something I've ordered. Probably an eBay thing. Oh yes. <laughs> now remember, if you a couple was it an episode or two ago, I got the, the white greyhound of Richmond and it was tainted. I had a bit of a back and forth with the guy 
indeed it was he wasn't very forthcoming to be honest with you so i'll probably never shop with him again um because it seemed uh what he did was he just he didn't even look at the coin. He says he didn't even look at the coin before posting it. I don't believe him whatsoever. It was just something about him. I didn't believe him. Who doesn't look at the coins before posting them? He's definitely one of those. I'll buy as many as I can and punt them as fast as I can. Because he hasn't had anything for sale since. So, but yeah. This one's a lot better condition. Please with that. Please with that. I'll keep, I'll, I'll give good feedback for this seller. There we go. So that's me on that one. I've just got to get, get the, uh, the next one. I think one of my CoinTuber friends has got the, the next one. I just need to convince him to send me it fast so I can do a wee review on it. <laughs> and add it to my growing collection of Queen's Beasts. This is going to be a beastly one, isn't it? Is there 10 of them? I think. Oh, we'll find out. I'll be skint by the time number 10 comes around. <laughs> Anywho, on to the next one. And this one here is a Westminster jobby. Now I've got one more, I've got a few more coming in, but this is the one that's come first. Any more evidence? Oh yes, there is evidence. More evidence, any more? Oh look, there we go, cracking. Excellent. I've been looking forward to this set since I heard about it coming out earlier in the year. Used to like watching this when I was young. Mr. Ben. Here we go. Let's open this up and see what it's like inside. Look at that. Oh, that takes me back. Mr. Ben, the 50p coin collection. There's your obverse, 2021, Guernsey. Beautiful. Let's open it up. Mr. Ben television show based on the book series by the same name was written and animated by Mr. Ben's creator, David McKee. I'll let you have a wee read of that. Here we go. Fantastic. <laughs> I do love these. Uh... All these statistics, specifications. Let's have a look at the Red Knight. <laughs> that does look a bit suspect, doesn't it? <laughs> I won't say. This is a family channel. <laughs> I like the detailing on the, 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 the roofs of the buildings, on the terrace bay windows. and Oh, they're lovely. I, love, I do like that. And the next one, the Cook. More, more terraced housing. Very, very nice. Mr. Ben 50. Quite like that. Quite like that. Let's move this down. And I'll have to move this a wee bit. The spaceman. That's pretty smart. Still like the terraced housing as well. It seems to be the theme throughout. And oh no, it's a clown. Look away if you don't like clowns. But um Yeah, I do quite like this. I'm going to be keeping that one for a good long while, I think. Happy childhood memories. Hey, so, anyway, I'll pop this away. And we'll crack on to the next one. See you in a wee minute. And this one. I'm not sure where this is from. Let's find out. Oh, it looks like a Pub Joy one, is it? Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, I forgot about this one. There we go. Now, yeah, there. I forgot I got this. South Georgia and Sandwich Islands. Angel wings. Oh, I should really be wearing my gloves for this one, shouldn't I? Pop this glove on. We'll do on my Michael Jackson thing, just wear one glove. There we go. Courage, commitment, compassion, competence, communication, and care. That is lovely. 
Next is Angel Wings. South Georgia and Sam South Sandwich Islands. It's a little mark there. Is that to be moved or no? It's a mark. Okay. Need to find a capsule for this or something. Put it in the wee pouch. I like that. It goes with the two pound coin that I bought from Pop Joy a wee while back. So what a cracking thing. Let's put this back in here. And let's have a recap of everything we've got today. So welcome back. Look at all this stuff that I've got today. Start off in the middle here. We've got the Mr. Ben set. Five pack. Oh, I like this. I really do. Takes me back to my childhood. And well, the silver ones, they are bonny, but they were too rich for my blood. If you got this one, let me know in the comments. Also, thank you for the pocket port postcard. Botanical Gardens. Lovely. Uh got the five pound five pound and ten pound note from hunting to for coins from the mister uh he's up for trades give him a shout we've got uh the two pound coin from uh pop joy with the angel wings bonny wee thing like that need a capsule for it though also got banknotes galore from scotland ireland and that we've got the 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 zz replacement note they've got the mary slessor paper note with the rbs polymer that i never got when i should have We've got the Royal University of Belfast thingy, £20 Irish paper note, and the £100 Bank of Scotland Keswick Bridge note. Also, we've got the 95th birthday Dripping the Colour coins. We've got the replacement White Greyhound of Richmond coin, which this, this seller was much better than the last one. The last one, very dubious, and mm, we'll probably never deal with him again. Uh, pleased with that one, though. Uh, got some coins here. I've got Flopsy Bunny, the sh Olympic shooting, the shield with the crown, one pound, the NHS, the two jersey coins, the Egyptian arch, and also we've got a couple for money boxes here. So I better get the money boxes out. That one there is for the train. Let's pop that in there. That's getting, that's getting heavy. That's getting heavy. And this one here, I'm going to take a wee while to fill this one up, but screw on looking coins, we'll be fine then. In they go. Gonna all add up. So, did you get any of these? Have you got the, these banknotes? Have you got these coins? Did you buy this pack? And what have you found in your change? I'm always interested to know. Leave me a wee comment down below. Um, I'm off for now. If you're having a hunt, have a happy one. Don't forget, check your change. I did. Uh, ciao for now, and cheery bye.